Hey viewers, what's going on? Welcome back to more Mega Man X for the Super Nintendo, an exclusive for GameAnyone.com. So, next boss whose ass is going to be kicked is, if I can remember <laughs> at all, it's this guy, I think. The Octopussy. The Launch Octopussy. Okay, I should be able to get the next heart in here. I could have gotten it in the first area. But as you could tell, you need to shoot either... I mean, I you can shoot faster. I probably didn't do it fast enough. I think I'm gonna do some revisiting to that level as well. See? I tried to do the slide in here, but I forget this fucking next. I cannot learn my lesson. I need this for the tank. Oops. And this anime is many bosses you can consider, I guess. Oops. No! This one is, is very easy anyway. The ones with spiky pits, of course, are more tedious to deal with. How many fucking lives? Seven. Don't worry about this fish. I don't really hit you. They just eat the shit out of you. Alright, this one is more complicated. Either when blowing or sucking. Yeah, of course, sexual terminology. In a playthrough from the Chilean Retro Gamer? No fucking way. What? Seriously, okay, you have to wait for these little tornadoes. Okay, well, this was completely optional. And that sound indicates that I got the tank completely filled with shits. So you can use that shit in your favor for your advantage. Alright, get up here. And destroy this thing, it's, well, so to speak, optional. But of course there is a reason for you to do this, and not to continue on, knowing that you can. Stress the floor, keep sinking, and... Surprise, surprise, secrets all day. Nice sound, I love this sound. I should either add the head or the tail. Oh my god, what this shit. No! In the face. Better get off. Oh, that's better. In the face, all day. Just bring it. Hey, it's working at least. Oh, come on! How many more hits do you take, brother? Ah, oh, about time. I think every single of these things is going to give me an item. Just one of them. Very generous. Now I can continue on and get surprise. I think this is my second heart. The idea for me is not to forget where I got these hearts and where I did not get them. I'm so forgetful. Ah, this guy again. But this one doesn't make the funny noise. <laughs> ah, there it is. What are you supposed to do to make that noise? This one takes longer, as you can tell, because he goes under the floor like a pussy. That 
That's weird, it doesn't make that noise as much as the other one. But now it does. Does he take damage for receiving hits on the tail? Looks like it, but you never know. Go, go, get him. Ooh, that was shorter. Give me items. Game is shit. Good stuff. This should be the last part of the level. Alright, now I got me hit because I didn't let myself to be swallowed. Alright, you are supposed to use this uh, weapon. How is this even called? I completely forgot. Ah, oh, the shield. This is probably the most tedious boss. from the... 8. I'm going to get my ass kicked! Oh, unless... Well, I said I would be using this in the last levels, but I forgot how much of a pain the ass this guy is, in particular. By the way, by the way, sorry. Uh, each of the tanks doesn't refill your entire energy bar. Just part of it. You need like two or three of those tanks to complete your bar if you make it as big as the one from the boss, for example. You so yeah, you need at least two or three of those tanks to refill your entire energy bar. So you are supposed to use those tanks wisely. No spamming like the energy tanks in the classic Mega Man series. So I got the tornado, right? So now I should be... No, not a tornado, I mean... Uh... Ah, the missiles. Since I got the missiles, I'm fighting this guy now. The Boomerang Faggot. Boomer Kawanger. Good names. Dot com. Right, I, I find this level kind of weird and gay too, because of those type of jumps. Can you throw it, please? Thank you so fucking much. Oops. Ah, oh, okay. Of course, I'm getting my energy filled again. My tank filled with energy. Sorry again. Oh my god! So oh, good, man! Yeah, the level is weird and the music is kind of stressful to me. Nice, more energy for the tank. And even more. More than the half. You know, in case of a little accident. Why didn't you dash? Whatever, I'm passing th through as quick as I can. These enemies are not... It's not as tedious as it looks like. There you go. A totally not generic elevator from video games. Even Mega Man needed an elevator level. It's quite short anyway. There's another level in which I'll have to revisit in order to get the heart. Because I precisely need the weapon you are given in this level for you to reach that. I'm trying to remember if there is another item. No, I don't think so. So yeah, fuck you. Nothing for you, faggot. I don't think those enemies respawn. So I can take my time.
Yeah, it's right here. You need the boomerang to get that one. Actually, you need the boomerang for you to get another tank, which the one I mentioned back in the Spark Mandria level. That's why I have to revisit that one too. I wonder if this there is going to be a level which I'm not going to revisit. That's a good question. I need to get the other parts of the armor, I completely forgot. Fight these enemies and my missile or missile is what's going to help me to defeat this motherfucker. Who thinks he is cool because he teleports like that? In a rather homosexual way. Homie missile, as you can tell, so no matter where I am and where he is, he's getting his ass kicked. It's a bad copy of Catman. There you go, did it. I did it! Boomerang Cutter. Basically, Catman's weapon from Mega Man 1. Okay, that's all for now. Next time, I'm going to defeat the Sting Chameleon and. Who's next? The Eagle. So, yeah, talk to you later.